On another episode of the Whatever Podcast, host Brian Atlas once again made the argument that women wearing makeup is deceiving, citing the fact that men's attraction to women is based on how attractive their children will be once they reproduce. Insinuating that makeup makes it hard for men to determine this when meeting a woman. And so one of the reasons we seek out an attractive partner, one of the reasons, aside from our own sort of selfish desires, although this would also just be selfish, is if we have children with them, our children would be attractive. Okay. Okay. Not necessarily. So when a woman lies about her physical appearance, either through makeup usage, plastic surgery, or filter usage. I was usage. waiting for you to make that connection and that's really what it is. Like you really, like you get into a relationship with someone thinking about like what your future is going to look like. So the point I'm trying to make is that makeup, men cannot utilize. If you go into a relationship and your purpose is to think about the physical attractiveness of your children and not about like you know whether he's a good person yeah. and he's someone Why? you could see yourself lasting forever with it just it doesn't make like your, i'm not your saying mom, that's the sole reason like, why that's not my argument that that's the sole your reason argument is that's why attraction matters right the irony here is that he and his newfound co-host andrew wilson are both sitting there with beards on their faces to hide their own insecurities which is what he accuses women of using makeup for makeup enhances features that are already there it can't hide them Makeup cannot hide a weak or double chin. Beards can. And beards do. If makeup is deceptive, then beards are equally as deceptive. Because until that man shaves his beard, women have no idea what he actually looks like underneath it. They have no idea if there's a weak chin there, or a double chin, or no chin at all. A woman's makeup is taken off every day, easily wiped off of her face when the day is over. A man doesn't shave his beard every night to reveal what's underneath. A man isn't going to just shave his beard the first night of meeting a woman so that she knows what he really looks like underneath. He isn't going to shave it the next day either, or the next. Men rarely will shave for a woman, period, if they have beards or any kind of facial hair. So if it's so important to be upfront and honest about what your entire face looks like for the reproduction of future offspring, then you shouldn't grow a beard until after you've already secured a woman, so that she can see what your face looks like entirely so that she knows what genetic features her children will have. Fair is fair.